Several people have questioned how visual cross-betting features in the Tamala limestone indicate a windblown or aeolian deposit. To answer, I visited Formby in northwest England, a dynamic region of active sand dune formation with localised areas of erosion exposing the same cross-betting features. Consistent wind patterns cause sand to accumulate and form dunes. Wind transports sand grains up the windward side of the dune to the crest and then down the leeward side, creating these angled layers known as cross-bedding. Cross-bedding layers, each just a few millimetres wide, become visible only on the freshly eroded faces of the dunes. The visual similarity between the cross-bedding in Formby dunes and those in the Tamala limestone represent a similar landward aeolian formation process.